Astral Radiance Booster Box. That is what we are opening up in today's video. We have 36 thick, juicy packs we gotta get into. The reason we're getting this booster box open so late is because your boy attended his first ever regionals for uh, the Vancouver event. For today's giveaway prize, we're going to be giving away the Hoopa promo right here from the Hoopa V box along with the three promos from the uh, collector's chest that recently dropped featuring Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott. Comment down below what your chase cards are for Astral Radiance and if you've opened anything up from the set, what you pulled that you're like really, really proud of. All right, so to kick things off, we have the Typhlosion pack art right, from the left side. We're just gonna do all the left side at once and then we'll do all the right side right after. And then of course, we're gonna do a little pull recap as well. And uh, when it comes to the chase cards for this set, the major ones we're after are of course going to be Palkia, Palkia V-Star, Darkrai, Darkrai V-Star, and I think the Machamp alternate art is really, really good as well. So hopefully we can pull that. There's just so many good cards in the set. Karelia and a Hisuian Arcanine. But uh, if you guys want to see more Astral Radiance pack openings, I'll leave links down below to a couple of videos. I see we've got a black, co oh no, black code card's the good code card for this, for this set. Um, so, uh, so yeah, if you guys want to see more Astral Radiance pack openings, I'll leave videos linked down below. And of course, if you guys are looking to purchase any Astral Radiance cards, I'll have my eBay store linked down below, along with Manta Trading and a couple other uh, Pokemon card selling websites that are all safe, and a Galarian Obstagoon Trainer Gallery right there with Piers over there. And the uh, Galarian Obstagoon is singing his heart out with the microphone. And a Hisuian Lilligant V, not too bad. I'll happily take that. Ooh, we do want to get the uh, Gardena's Vigor full art. That's a major chase for us this uh, this set, along with the uh, the Starmie, the Starmie Trainer Gallery with the Misty just vibing on the pool or whatever. So there's some major pulls we want to get as well in this set. Uh, so let's just keep it going. We're not going to do the pack trick for a lot of these packs just because there's 36 packs. Oh, nothing really big there. No need to do the pack trick every single time, but I'll do it occasionally. Like, we'll look at it. I know it's a white coat card. We're just gonna bust through it real quick with a chance at getting a trainer gallery card in the reverse hollow slot, which is always nice. One really good thing about Astro Radiance is the trainer gallery. That means every single booster pack, no matter the code card color, uh, will give you a shot at the, uh, some nice, something nice, you know, something, something juicy. All right, so we know what this is a, a black code card. It's gonna be something good in here. We got Dark Patch, Magneton, Rowlet, Bronzor, Oshawott, Hoot Hoot, Cricketot. Ooh, nice, a Radiant Heat Ran. That is a good card. And a Hasuian uh, Decidueye Hollow. So not a bad pack at all. So yeah, I think we'll just do that when it's a white code card. We'll skim through it. And if it's a black code card like that right now, we're gonna do the card trick. And uh, that way I can potentially use the footage for a TikTok or Instagram. If you guys haven't yet followed your boy on TikTok or Instagram, it's Sneaker Talk TCG. And uh, my actual main Instagram is Sneaker Talk CA. Ooh, or a Guru V, I'll happily take that. That is a solid hit. This is a full art too? I'm like 90% sure this is a full art. That is dope. I love Orin Guru. He made my Zation deck run very smoothly. But here we go, next pack. Full art, you love to see it. You love to see a full art. All right, let's see what we got here. Trainer gallery hit, no, we got a Reggie Ice. That is good though. This is very sellable because that Reggie deck is becoming really, really popular. I think it might become one of the, if not the most popular like single prize decks in the format. It might take over Malamar. Uh, Rapid Strike Malabar. I've never really played Rapid Strike Malabar. I like something with less math. Uh, but here we go. This is a black code card. We got Pillow Sworn, Mischievous, Barboach, Scyther, Eevee, Heracross, Eevee once again, and a. Ooh, an Oranguru V. And there we go. So we definitely got the full art in the last pack. Two Oranguru Vs. Is this a sign to build an Oranguru V deck? I don't even know if that's a thing. Typically, Orin Guru is like more of a, like a, a support kind of Pokemon, not really a, a Pokemon that's going to be like the main star of a deck. But let's see what we got here. We have a Zishu, a Zishu Reverse Hollow that's going to go straight up onto the eBay store. You guys can go ahead and redeem some of these Astral Radiance codes. I'm going to redeem a lot of them, but some of them I will let slip through the cracks and you guys can grab them. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Next pack, Astral Radiance Booster Box, a Dartrix, Drifblum, Ursaring, Togepi, Shatsot, Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Suing Sneasel, Glaceon, and a Absol Hollow Rare. This is actually a card you can get as a non-hollow exclusive rare 
in the build and battle boxes. Uh, I actually have quite a few of those now. So if you guys ever want to see like how competitive Pokemon card tournaments goes or, you know, a pre-release event or two, I do have those vlogs on the channel. Um, we did one for the pre-release of Astral Radiance at Manta Trading and that was great. Uh, and then I also went to 401 and I went undefeated in that pre-release. And then I actually brought my girlfriend to one uh, on our staycation and uh, had a, we had a good time. We had a pretty good time there. So, Thievil and a Hisuian Bribery right there, non-hollow. So, uh, so yeah, a lot more, a lot more tournament vlogs on the way. I do know the homies over at 401 Games is hosting, they're hosting a uh, $2,000 Pokemon card tournament. So that'll be a fun event this Saturday. White code, we're gonna skip right through it and see what we get. It is a Ponyard and a Shaman. The Shaman art's pretty nice. Typically, because it's a booster box and it's a new set, I would go kind of slow. Uh, but I do know this video is up basically a week and a half late. I know that not everyone's gonna wanna appreciate the art slowly for all these cards, but you do know that, you know, after this, after this opening is done, I'm gonna take my time, go through all these cards. Like Silene's a really good card for Mew decks. Um, I'm gonna go through these cards one by one. I really like le reading the lore and stuff on the cards and appreciating the art of everything, not just like the full arts and stuff like that. Super effective glasses and a Heatran V full art. I'll happily take that. That art is cool. Like the background is like a, a rainbow gradient. That's really cool actually. I'll take that. I did pull the VMAX uh, the other day, so that might be a potential deck I could run if I wanted to, but uh, if not, I can always sell it on my eBay store. And as usual, if you guys mention Sneaker Talk TCG in the uh, the purchase notes, if you buy anything, you can get an extra 5% off, which I'll bless you with, uh, with a refund. So, uh, so yeah, I do have to list a lot of these Astral Radiance cards on my eBay store later on. And if you guys are looking for singles that I don't have for sale on eBay, you of course can use code Sneaker Talk TCG on Manta Trading's website to get 5% off their Pokemon cards, sealed and singles. That's actually where I bought this booster box from. So shout out to Manta holding me down and uh, making sure I have some product I can buy when I came back from Vancouver. They were allowed to sell like some Astral Radiance early, like a few few days early, because they did the pre-release events. And uh, they pretty much effectively sold out um, before I got to the store, but uh, we're homies with Manta, so they managed to secure six packs I could open up, which I really appreciated. And I bought a, a few ETBs. Obama Snow, Single Strike. Ooh, Trainer Gallery. Who's the trainer in the background? That's pretty cool. I like the hollow. It is very, very shiny, very rainbowy. And a non hollow Mighty Yenna, but this card is actually really nasty against Mew decks. You can one hit KO the Mew VMAX, but you don't really see too many people playing Dark to counter Mew VMAX or just Mew, because Mew is just so good. Mew is so, 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 so good. So this deck, sorry, not this deck, but this set, Astral Radiance, uh, has a new best deck in format card potentially, an S tier deck. Maybe it's not the best deck in format, but it is an S tier deck. We got the Palkia. And uh, Palkia is definitely something I want to play. I want to try and pull some Palkia cards or Darkrai. Darkrai has a lot of potential as well. So here we go. We got a Choi Reverse Hollow and a Weirdier. A Weirdier Reverse, not Reverse, Weirdier Hollow Rare. Next pack up, a White Coat card. We're gonna breeze through this real quick. And a Togekiss Reverse Hollow. Is that a rare? Yeah, Reverse Hollow Rare Togekiss. Not bad. And a Reggie Drago. You need those for those Reggie decks and the code right there. Two more packs for the left side. And then we're gonna kick it over to the right, right after this. And hopefully the right side can bless us with a V-Star because we are almost 18 packs deep with not a single V-Star. My, my luck for V-Star pulls, I don't know about you guys, but for me, pulling V-Stars has become like an impossible task. So one day, you know, maybe one day I'll pull a V-Star, Cleavor River or non hollow right there. And we did open up the Cleavor V-Star box. So if you guys want to see the pulls we got from the Cleavor V-Star box, V-Star, Cleavor V-Star box, I'll leave it linked down below. And uh, we're actually giving away uh, the V-Star and the Full Art V Cleavor in that video. So check it out if you guys want to enter for that giveaway. All right, Grass Energy, Corellia, Grant, Togetek, Bergmite, Hippopotamus for Christmas, Scyther, Cyndaquil, another Hisuian Growlithe, and hey, Hisuian Typhlosion V. I'll take that. I love Typhlosion, and to see him as a psychic Pokemon is really, really trippy and cool to see. Let's get this underway, and hopefully my desk does not like overfill with too many Pokemon cards where they start falling on the floor. All right, white code card. Let's skip through it, and a Jubilife Village and a Glaceon for that pack right there. Hisuian Decidueye's pack up next, and uh, how about this? If we can pull a V-Star, 
I will try and build a deck based around that V-Star because I just, I can't pull a V-Star. Maybe that's the, that's the call I need to make. I have to build the deck of the next V-Star card I pull. So hopefully that's something that can happen. A Grant and a Reggie Drago non-holo. All right, Typhlosion. Can we get a Typhlosion V-Star? But the ideal card we can pull, like the, the most expensive V-Star card in the set, I think is like a tie at $45 for Palkia V-Star and Darkrai V-Star. I really haven't seen Darkrai pop off as like a super S tier meta deck in a lot of deck, uh, like uh, top 10 decks kind of videos that people are making on YouTube. But Palkia is, oh, there we go, Radiant Greninja. That is a, one of the best, if not the best uh, Radiant card you can pull in the set. The Shiny Greninja you can play as a basic, both amazing as a supporter card, as a supporting Pokemon, but amazing as a secret attacker as well. And a Decidueye, Hisui and Decidueye V. What a great pack right there, double banger. You'll love to see it. Really good pack right there. That's probably one of the best packs you can ask for. A Radiant Greninja plus a Hisui and Decidueye V. And actually Hisui and Decidueye V and the V Star have become pretty popular as like one of one offs in certain decks. There was a while when a lot of Japanese decks in the Champions League we're all running a 1-1 one, one lineup of that. We got a Mighty and a non holo but the Hasui and Typhlosion. That is a dope reverse holo rare to pull. Very happy with that. And the mess we are making in my room. If my mom were to see this mess we're making, oh my gosh, she would roast me. Bruh. She would roast me like crazy, but hopefully she doesn't see this. I, I clean up my room pretty fast. All right, Shell, Shell Dion, Hasui and Heavy Ball, Pur Ugly, Swinub, Hasui and Quillfish, a Petalil, Nicket, Hippopotas, Sudowoodo and a Leafeon non hollow Again, make sure you guys enter the giveaway for the Hoopa V promo and the uh, the collector's chest promos. All you have to do is comment down below what your chase cards are for Astral Radiance. And uh, if you did pull any heat, let me know what you have pulled so far. But uh, let's go. Next pack, Duwat, Bronzor, Rowlet, Oshawott. We got all the starters, Stantler and Ursaring and a Deancey. All right, this is a good hollow to pull. Not bad at all. The art's nice, and I like the hollow. The hollow effect on the DNC is pretty cool. And if I do want to build a Dialga deck, that is a card that is essentially a must-have for uh, for Dialga decks because it prevents your Dialga from getting bosses ordered to get knocked out because the DNC does protect it from uh, supporter cards that target the bench. So, really handy card for those Dialga V Star decks trying to pull off that turn, their V-Star power for an extra attack. And we got the Gardevoir card, the Simp Full Art, or a Simp Trainer Gallery right here. And a Mamoswine, nice. We did pull the Gardevoir a couple of times in the past, so not a super crazy card, but definitely a card that I can easily sell on eBay because a lot of people love Gardevoir, let's face it. Definitely a Pokemon a lot of people like to have a collection of in their binders, and I don't blame them. Gardevoir is a pretty dope Pokemon, but here we go. Next pack, a Water Energy, Trekking Shoes, a Golduck, Grant, Hisuian Growlithe, Bergmite, Rufflet, Ponyta, Chattot, a Rowlet, Reverse Hollow, and a, <gasps> a Mama, a Mama Champ, a Mama V, <laughs> Machamp V Max. There we go. The other day, I actually pulled two back to back, back, back to back. I pulled two back to back Machamp V Maxes in the online trading card game. That is crazy to me. So Machamp V Max, pretty cool card. But with Mew being as dominant as it is in the meta, it is honestly a death sentence to be playing a uh, particular, particular uh, fighting type Pokemon just because of weakness. Ooh. And uh, Dark Pokemon haven't completely removed Mew from its top spot. Roxanne, Togetek, a Barboach, Scytha, Eevee, Heracross, Teddy Ursa, Gutsy Pickaxe, and a Reggie Steel non hollow. All right, final eight packs before we're gonna go get some iced coffee so I can get some more energy to film some more Pokemon opening videos. All right, let's get this thing. I do know it's a black code card. I did see that little peak. So we're not gonna ruin the surprise, but we do have something good in here. All right, Grass Energy, Jubilee Village, Dartrix, Driftblum, a Petalil, Nickit, Hippopotas, Cyndaquil, Hisui and Quillfish. <gasps> There we go, an Ice Rider Calyrax VMAX from the Trainer Gallery. What a great pull, and I am trying to build a deck, but we know there's a hollow behind this. So what's behind it? Let's find out. A Darkrai V, oh my gosh. This is this is even better than the Radiant Greninja uh, booster pack with the Hisui and Decidueye. Hopefully we didn't use up all our luck 
in that, <laughs> that, that pack right there. Uh, but I'm very, very happy with that. I am trying to build an Ice Rider deck. Ice Rider with Palkia might be my last choice, like my third choice for a competitive deck. I really want to play Palkia though. But here we go. Next pack. Ralts, Sneasel, Mischievous, Bastiodon, and a... Oh, well, cool. An Adamon. This guy definitely has a lot of simps, all right? I don't blame him. He's a good looking fella. If there's girls out there who want the full art trainer, I will eventually sell it when I get it. Uh, cause I, I don't, I don't simp for guys, okay? I'll simp for a waifu. I won't simp for a husbando. That's just how it is. But it is Pride Month, so happy Pride Month to everybody. Here we go, next pack. Kamado, Noctowl, Suian Basculin, Glamia, Puchiena, Swinub, Suian Quillfish, Pillow Swine. Oh, what the heck? Oh, uh, yeah, we got Swinub earlier. Cool. So we got the lineup right there. Can we get a Mamo Swine? Nope. We got Suian bribery right there. I'll show you guys my desk at the end of the video. It looks like an arts and craft project. That's that's what my desk currently looks at. And the floor too. There's like pack arts everywhere all over the floor. All right, let's see if this is gonna be a banger pack or not. Nope, white code card. So we're gonna drop that code and see what is inside. A Hasuian Quillfish and a Regilecki. It seems like a lot of the, the white code card non hollows uh, non hollow rares we get, we keep getting the Regis. I might wanna build a Regi deck. I, I might do it, you know? I'm not a big guy, I'm not a, not a big guy, I'm not a big guy, but I'm also not a big fan of single prize decks. I really like the power that V's and V stars and V maxes can bring to the table. Uh, but if I were to build a single prize deck, you know, Reggie's might be an option to go. Competitively viable. Teddy Ursa, Mansign, Suin Voltorb, a Hippopotas, and a Ursa Luna. All right, three packs remaining. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Palkia, let, let's do Palkia last. The Sidui. Up next. And we're gonna do the card trick for all these since it's just the final three. We have a Dark Energy, Cranotis, a Gold Duck, Switch Cart, Rufflet, Ponyta, Rowlet, Bronzor, Ashawat, a Bronzong, and a Reggie Ice. See, I'm telling you, we keep getting the dang Reggies. Second last pack of the video, Dialga Pack Cart. Let's go. Astral Radiance, baby. Let's get this W. Let's see what we can get. We got a Water Energy, Sheldon. Silene, Pur Ugly, Rot, Sneasel, Mischievous, Barboach, Scyther, Hasuian, Heavy Ball, and a Absol Holo Rare. All right, we've pulled zero V Stars. Ooh. All booster box. Final pack. Oh my gosh, I hit the microphone. Final pack. Last pack magic with the Palkia. Let's go. Let's get this, please. Just one V Star. That's all I'm asking. Just a singular. V star one two three four if you guys made it to the end make sure you guys hit that like button and enter the giveaway for the promos that i mentioned earlier in this video but here we go last pack magic a do what hoot hoots cricket tots a stantler a suian quillfish a scyther a reverse hollow cleavor and drum roll please our final card of the booster box is oh thievil <laughs> This is the mess we have on my table. Oh my gosh, all the hits are like all here. And then, wow, no V-Stars. 